Second time you've beaten your former team where you were an assistant this season. How special is it to play this Auburn team? Uh, you know what, it's amazing. Um, Karen is unbelievable in what she's done and continues to do with that program. And for them to have back-to-back -back seasons like they have um, is, is incredible. Um, it's, I think it's only fitting for me personally um, to be playing Auburn on Thanksgiving week because uh, it's all about family and I've got family on both sides today and as much as I'm happy for this one, I'm, I'm sad for, the, for my family on the other side. But um, what an incredible season and, and incredible competitors they were today. Second Final Four appearance in school history. How proud are you of this group? Uh, you know what, I'm super proud. Today was uh, a really hard for a game. Um, it was great to get the goal early, but um, the grit, the tenacity of, of Auburn was unbelievable today. And, and for, our, for our kids to hold on and, and just find a way was, was incredible. Did the physicality of the match surprise you at all? No, not at all. You know, everybody's playing, you know, this is one and done and it's for a chance to go to the Final Four. You only expect the, the energy and the excitement uh, to, to carry itself into the game. And, and today is one of those games. You just had to find a way to, to, to pull it out, but not at all. Uh, um, everybody was just playing to win. What did this team do so well that made them successful today? Um, one, we scored early. I mean, I, I think it's easier to play from the front, especially when, when you've got a team on the other side that defends so very well. Um, but they stayed together. Uh, the unity, the energy from both sides of the field um, was, was fantastic, and, and the work rate of the players, the, the focus was good. And uh, at the end of the day, you know, you, you, we caught a bounce or two along the way. We missed a chance or two, um, but it was it was togetherness. It was unity today. So, how do you keep the group, get the group ready now for the final four in San Jose? Um, well, we enjoy this one, um, and then then we'll we'll take a day off and kind of recover, and, and then we'll just get back at it. We'll. Coach has got to go to work and, and see who comes out uh, for our next opponent. And, and uh, then we just do what we've been doing. Stay, stay in the plan, stay in the process, and, and focus on the next one. Alex, walk us through your goal. Um, it was honestly all Bing. Uh, I saw the ball get back out, out pop out to Bing and um, made an near post run. Luckily, Nico heard me calling for her to get out, and she uh, got out, and Bing whipped it in, right foot. So, uh, yeah, and I just got on the end of it, headed it. How important is it to score that early goal? How much that helped maybe with the nerves even? It is so important. We wanted to uh, hop out on the scene like really quickly. It's something that sort of we had uh, been struggling to do the last couple games. So to put one away that early was really good and it sort of helped uh, I think the team's overall uh, mentality to just sort of want to slow the game down and, and being confident in our, in our ability to do that. What did you make of this game? It seems really physical out there. Yeah, it, that's an understatement. Um, probably one of the most physical games we've played and the team obviously came out of it um, giving it right back and uh, not stepping down so I think it's a great message to send that you know we might be a California team but hey we're ready to fight. How proud are you of this team? I am so proud of this team. I cannot be more proud of this team. Uh, it's my first year here and uh, first Final Four in a long time and um, it was a team effort for sure and I'm, I'm so excited to be part of this and so happy for this team. What, does, what do you all have to do now to, to refocus for San Jose? Um, I think that we just need to celebrate this win, um, be happy about it uh, for today, maybe tomorrow, and then when we come back and, and on Sunday and we get back out to it, we lock in and realize that we have something bigger in front of us and we're still trying to achieve our ultimate goal.